Okay, here's your Kenmore 400 series. That's the old school mechanical timer, which I like. And what's happened to this one is basically it will not spin. And it's acting like it's acting like the basket has come loose from the transmission shaft. So there's uh, there's like a collar that's held on with a nut over the main shaft here, and that holds the basket to the transmission shaft, and that has de disintegrated. So we'll have to put a new one on. Okay, we got the agitator off. This is 7 16th bolt. You're using nut driver and a wrench or whatever, long extension 7 16th. Yeah, I was wrong. So basically, usually you'll see some little pieces of metal right here and here that's sticking through. So the spin tube, yeah, so there's the spin tube right there. The spin tube, so it's, it's come up, the whole basket has come up over. So it's riding over whatever the spin tube where it has the spline. You can see the spline right there. If you watch when I move this tub, the spline will disappear. See, it's disappeared. And so what we need to do is loosen this nut, reseat the basket on that spline so it's all sitting on the spline tighten that nut back up and it grabs that spin tube and we should be good and thanks for watching if you need any help you can contact me 707-443-8347 i give phone advice for 39 dollars also on commercial machines as well okay the way i take these things off is basically i'll take a box stand wrench and a hammer and then pound on the edge of the box stand and it comes off it will usually come off this one was loose because I don't know, it was just loose, and so we already know it's loose because it's, uh, it's come loose from here. And so we're going to have to probably lift the basket up just a little bit and then set, that, set those uh, the drive tube uh, splines in this, it's like a collar, this collar here, set it in there. And, uh, and then we'll have to tighten that up real good, a lot tighter than it was before. Sometimes you have to take a torch and heat that up to get that nut off. They actually have a spanner. Uh, wrench for this particular thing. I've had three or four of them, but uh, people steal them or uh, Yeah, that's what happens basically and uh, So I start fresh new With tools and sometimes end up with the basics and this is what I use to take this off Okay, so basically I just I was able to lift the basket up with my hand and maneuver that spline back in there and you can see that spline See the silvery edge right there? That spline's got to go right back up in there. Um, if that spline is not there or it's bent or something or it's whatever worn out here, then you'll have spin problems. Yeah, so this was a pretty easy fix, actually. Thanks again for watching. I get phone advice for $39, 707-443-8347, Pacific Time, 9 to 5. Now I'm going to give this little disclaimer about YouTube too. Now I've mentioned some things about personal uh, health advice. And YouTube has taken several of my videos off about that. I'm very disappointed in them. So if I don't post for a week or so, you probably know that YouTube has taken some of my videos off and or banned me I made a video on kind of natural mushrooms you could find in the wild and they banned me because I posted that and my comment about uh, the vaccinations and so if you don't see me on for a while they probably knocked me off and uh, I'll be looking for another video platform if you know of a better one please make note uh, in the comment section below thank okay, you so Basically, I just I was able to lift the basket up with my hand and maneuver that spline back in there And you can see that spline See the silvery edge right there that spline's got to go right back up in there um, If that spline Is not there or it's bent or something or it's whatever worn out here Then you'll have spin problems Yeah, so this was a pretty easy fix, actually. Thanks again for watching. I give phone advice for $39, 707-443-8347, Pacific Time, 9 to 5. 
Now I'm gonna give this little disclaimer about YouTube too. Now I've mentioned some things about personal uh, health advice. And YouTube has taken several of my videos off about that. I'm very disappointed in them. So if I don't post for a week or so, you probably know that YouTube has taken some of my videos off and or banned me. I made a video on kind of natural mushrooms you could find in the wild and they banned me because I posted that and my comment about uh, the vaccinations. And so if you don't see me on for a while, they probably knock me off. And uh, I'll be looking for another video platform. If you know of a better one, please make note uh, in the comment section below. Thank you.